The trendy district of Mitte has become Berlin's centre for fashion. But the new kid on the block, which opened doors at the end of February, offers something a little bit different. The label Heftling, the German word for prisoner, is made or inspired by those in jail. Up to 20% of the fashion is produced in jails like this one in the eastern German town of Halle. The men here are serving terms of up to four years in prison and during their time learn how to make the label's items such as this apron from scratch. But for the men in the workshop, the job is about more than just learning how to sew. It gets you out of the cell and you have more money to spend. If you don't work, you get 30 euros and from that you have to pay your electricity bills, which leaves you only 20 euros to spend. But this way I have as much as 80 euros per month to spend. My mother used to be a seamstress and I could never understand how she could sit at a sewing machine all day. Now though I understand and I have to say that it's a very good way of passing the time. Ordinarily, the men are only allowed out of their cells for an hour a day, so being able to work gives a much-needed change of scene. But the work's also useful for later on. It will help me when I get out of prison. I didn't really have much of this sort of thing before because of unemployment. This is helping me to get back on my feet and learn what it means to work. According to Winfried Gross, the main aim is to get back to normal life. Although most of the men won't actually work as tailors once outside of prison, the job does help them get used to the working day. One advantage is that it allows them to get out and about. The other advantage, though, is the extra money. They're allowed to spend some now while the rest is put aside for when they get out of prison. This is to be used to set themselves up, such as getting an apartment and furnishing it. The end product is sold here in Berlin, together with fashion inspired by jail, such as these designs drawn by prisoners themselves. But the label also has a social responsibility. We think that it's important that everybody outside knows that there is a big community sitting in prison and having not an easy life as we have outside. And of course the money we will raise will help too. More complicated goods are not made in jail. In this case though, Heftling donates 3% of the profits to groups which help prisoners, such as anti-death penalty organisations.